hi guys welcome back to my channel i hope you guys are all doing well today we have another hair review from love me hair they sent me this gorgeous unit um i'm just showing you everything that comes in the packaging with some goodies um so there i am just wiping up my hairline all the hair specs will be in the info down below in the description box down below i'm using um What's this called ghost bond yeah i'm using ghost bond today and i did two layers and another spray of black ebon um yeah literally that's it um yeah i've actually missed doing voiceovers i hope you guys are all doing well um yeah <laughs> it's nice to you know do a voiceover even though i'm recovering from a cold but yeah so i'm just layering the um glue around my hairline and yeah this unit I think is a 7x4 or 4x7 but you can see it's given like 6x6 the parting space is really really wide and it's a closure wig it's a wet and go wig so you don't really need to use glue I'm just being extra you can just pop it on and you're out of the door and you're good literally so I'm just using my heat protectant on the hair and you know I'm just gonna blow dry the hair out um, yeah just using um, my Revlon round brush really really handy really really easy to use I can't lie to you you need to get your hands on this dryer so quick so easy it just gets everything really really done um, so yeah I'm just blow drying the hair just so when I'm styling it it is easier for me and um yeah the hair the hairline is super dense um yeah but i did go ahead and you know i did customize that to my own liking um yeah and the lace is so thin as well and the hair minimal shedding as per usual and um, the hair is full for a closure it is full it is nice and the hair is just bouncy you guys will see the results at the end i'm just um plucking like my part in space because i intend to wear this week in a closure i mean closure in a straight parting rather than a side parting so yeah i'm just cutting off the excess lace i was struggling to see here i can't even lie to you but got there in the end um and i'm just using the ebbing black spray to lay down the remaining lace and i'm gonna go with my elastic band to keep that secure and in place So I'm just defining my parting using my concealer and um, yeah I actually plucked the parting because it was really really dense and I'm using mascara to clean up any any jaggedy um, line or anything and using my wax stick and my hot comb this hair is actually lush I love it the shedding is super minimal the hair is full like really really full for a closure wig and here I'm just doing a bit of weeders peak just so the hairline can look like a bit similar to mine and I'm just plucking that and yeah literally also using my hot comb to press everything down so everything can be seamless I really love the way I did the widow's week on my baby hairs I love the way the result came out and I'm gonna use my little hair straightener to you know start molding my baby hairs and start styling them using the razor to cut the excess off guys can you see the lace the lace is super seamless I did went ahead and you know I did blend that out of my um, foundation just so it's a bit more seamless um yeah and i'm using the spray and mousse to mold my baby hairs um after molding them just come them out so you can have that fluffy look if you do want that fluffy look and um yeah just literally doing the same process on the other side as i said all information all links this will be in the description box down below so if you guys want to shop this week go ahead and click the link below um yeah the week is super easy um you don't really have to do all this it's just me being extra you can literally um just use the elastic band that comes inside it um to you know style your wig and make it you know stay in place you don't have to lay it down with glue you can just pop it on and you're good to go it's a glueless unit actually i'm just being extra here 
but yeah i'm really loving that i come so far um make sure you invest in a hot comb to press everything together because look at how flat and seamless my pattern is please now i'm gonna add some curls to it because yeah i really really love the way this turned out i'm happy i did add curls to it because it just looks so lush you can wear it straight as well if you want but yeah i'm just using my tresemme i'm curling wand or i don't know what that is even called honestly i think it's called curling wand just using that to you know create some curls to the hair you guys will see how it looks like so 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 seamless So now I've actually curled everything. I'm just using some hairspray just so the curls can stay in place. Um, I did went already with hairspray though. <laughs> and I'm taking my pins out. Um, I did let it stay for a bit. So like 10 minutes I believe. So the curls can actually, you know, be cool. They can cool down and, you know, stay in place for a little bit. So now I'm just using a white tooth comb first to brush the curls out and doing that the other side. I really really love the way this hairstyle came out. I'm gonna still go ahead with my paddle brush and um, you guys will see that in a second to you know brush out the curls. I feel like when you use the paddle brush it gives them more definition than when you use a comb. Do you guys see what I mean? Like they just it just looks sleek and seamless and I don't know yeah. And um, yeah, I had to go back with my hot comb to, you know, press down everything that was bumpy, humpty, bumpty. <laughs> and um, yeah, I do love, 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 love this test army. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. I'm going to leave the rest of the clips here. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, if you did, please make sure you give some lovely comments down below. Um, thank you always for your support and your love as per usual. I do appreciate every single one of you guys. Okay, thank you. Bye. Mwah.